Now, most of you have attended many weddings before, but each one is different. So I ask you to please pay close attention to my attendant as we go through the safety briefing to ensure you all have an enjoyable evening. Ding dong. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is your MC speaking. First, I'd like to welcome you all to the wedding of Tim and Sinead. Please, could you take a moment to familiarise yourself with the exits? These are located here, here, and here. The toilets are out the marquee and to the right. Men, you can literally go anywhere by the pond, just not in it. The house is off limits. That is off limits unless previously organised. This is a non-smoking venue. This also includes vaping and e-cigarettes. If you wish to partake in this filthy habit, there is a designated smoking area up the drive and two kilometres down the road. I'm just kidding, but please do smoke outside the mucky and use the butt box provided. Please ensure your glasses are always full. However, in the case of an emergency and you do find your glass empty, there is a whistle on your life jacket or simply wave your arms for attention. I'm kidding again, please don't do that. The staff will ensure glasses are always full, so please head up to the bar. There are also non-alcoholic beverages provided for the pregnant or the pussies. In the likelihood of a long and boring speech, please assume the brace position. Arms in front, cross them over, and place your head down on the table in front of you. We may a bit experience a bit of turbulence later this evening due to too much beer or wine. If this is the case, there are sick bags located at the entrance of the marquee. The bride and groom have requested that you take plenty of pictures on the Polaroid camera, write a message and place in the box for them to open with a bottle of wine and relive the memories on their first wedding anniversary. You may post photos on social media, however, please don't add photos of the bride and groom until they have uploaded themselves. <laughs> there is a love heart guest book where you write your message on a heart and put it in. Just use one heart per person, please. For all you adventurous folk, feel free to jump in the pond at some stage this evening. Only enter where Steve has signage on the right side or jump off the jetty. Please don't walk up the sides as it has clay on the bank, ruins the lovely clear water, and this will really upset Steve. <laughs> at the end of the evening, there will be a bus at 11.30 to transfer you to your pre-booked accommodation. Please be aware, there are a few eligible bachelors with us this evening, so single ladies, you may not end up at your chosen destination. <laughs> now sit back, drink, dance, and enjoy the evening with an approximate party time of six hours. Thank you. Woo!